Hey guys, welcome back to Hype RC. In today's video, we're going to be modifying our FCX24 back into a two-speed crawler like it was meant to be. Now, we had modified this guy into a monster truck, and it's been a lot of fun. But now we have our FMS Max Smasher. Got this a few weeks ago. Got a whole bucket of upgrades. It's going to go on this guy, too, in an upcoming video. But in this one, I want to concentrate on turning this back into a crawling rig. So what we're going to do is I've got some brand new upgrades that finally showed up from Treel. I've got some new upgrades that finally showed up from Enjora. We're going to get those and put them on. So let's get this thing on the bench and check it out. All right, guys, let's take a quick look at the upgrades that we're going to do to our FCX24. First, we got our extended rear links with meta rear axle. These are new from Trio. These are going to be awesome. Can't wait to get those put on. We finally got our servo horns that fit the factory servo. I'm going to put the other one of these on the Max Smasher, but I've got a bunch of the factory servos in stock. I think they do real well, so that'll be a nice upgrade to have. We got the new Enjora 64 millimeter rock terrain s5 tires these things are super sticky super big they're going to look great on there finally got our enjora negative offset rims because if you remember with the original enjora rims and wheels that we had on here with this offset they weren't clearing the brass enjora portal cover so we've got these negative offset rims and we'll just throw these guys on some other rig sometime but we'll keep those in the back for stock for now but i'm excited i'm going to get all this stuff on and we'll take it out to the track just see how well it does All right, guys, let's go over how this thing performed out there on the rock course. We'll start off with the Trio 12 millimeter extended rear links. It also comes with a steel drive shaft. I am thrilled with the way that this thing performs. Uh, I highly recommend that as an upgrade for anybody that's got one of these. It's the best extended rear links that I have found so far. The servo horn is great. You get rid of that plastic one, get it off there. And then we'll talk about the new Enjora 64 millimeter super sticky rock crawling tires. These things are in the S5 compound and I thought the comp pin tires were amazing, but these are even better. They just Enjora just keeps raising the bar with their tires. In the 1.0 class, they are top notch. I, I'm really impressed with the direction they've headed. We also put on the stamp steel negative offset, which took care of all that rubbing, the issues we were having with the portal brass covers rubbing. So we've got that all taken care of. So we lengthened it, we widened it. The FCX24 has set a new bar and the 24 scale class and with the mods we keep putting on here it just keeps raising that now we still had the yh aliexpress shocks oil filled shocks and front links on this and i took the factory springs and cut two revolutions off of it and put those on here because the ones that came out of the factory with the yh were just way too stiff so i did that and now this thing you can see that it gets all kinds of articulation. So I really, really like this FMS rig. If you are thinking about spending $150 on a 24 scale rig, this is absolutely the top of the line. Box stock, it beats some of my 24 scale 
SEX 24s that I have a ton of money in and this thing I just keep adding mods and it just keeps getting better so anyways guys I really like the way that this thing performed with those mods on it today. Don't forget to support your local hobby shop, Bash Crawl Repeat. Hit the subscribe and like button for me and ring that bell so you can catch my next videos. We'll see you guys next time.